Bowl board plowing hasn't been common for decades, except for one Saturday every November on this field near Clinton. A lot of people like antique uh, jewelry, they like antique fixtures, they like antique furniture, and we just like old tractors and old rusty plows. That's exactly what brought 40 plus tractors and dozens more spectators to the 13th annual plow day on the Watlin family farm. It's fun and you don't see much of it anymore. I thought I was the only one interested in doing it when we, the first year we did it and I found out I was wrong. Some of these iron horses are restored show pieces, others only look good when they're working, and a couple are pretty rare. This is 1946. Oliver Cleat Track. My uncle bought it new at the Low Fair in 1946. It was on display there, and it's been in the family ever since. For the youngsters, this is probably their only chance to find out how their grandparents spent their autumn days. Like you know, how hard it is, how slow it is to work it. Sometimes they need a little help from someone who can actually reach the pedals. Well, I've never run one of these old tractors, but it's pretty cool. For all the operators, it's a chance to relax and reflect. What goes through my mind is I hope the tractor don't break down and I'm embarrassed in front of the John Deere people. Into Wake County. Mike Brooks, ABC News Channel 20.